off with the colors They kinda tell me what I'm thinking I fell in love with the way we are And the way we lose it There's something different about us And the reason why we stay Hi I don't want to be awake this early <laughs> If I'm honest with you I'm actually watching for my friend to come and pick me up or I'll take her once she gets here. I'm going to see her for a second. But, um, oh, I can't get here. <sighs> my friend texted me about 10 minutes ago. She's like, let's go for a walk. Let's go for a walk. She's like, I'll meet you there. Where do you like to go? And I was like, well, I like this new park, but I am, I'm not awake yet. She's like, all right, I'll give you 10 minutes. <laughs> so, um, she's on her way over and it'll be good because I had a very long day yesterday and part of it was kind of hard and part of it was like just emotionally exhausting. Um, talking to a couple of people in my family um, about my surgery and updates and things like that and um, so it was a little bit hard but um, and I'm not, I won't go into that but like um, anyway I just I was exhausted after the 4th of July um, because we got home at midnight um, the kids all needed to shower and I needed to do laundry for Abby because she had stuff that she needed for camp the next morning. And then we had to get up at 5.30 in the morning. Um, so I think I, we all went to sleep at 1 a.m. And then we had to be up at 5.30. I think Abby even got up before that because um, I had to get them over to the church uh, for their girls camp check-in and <laughs> by 6 a.m. Oh my gosh, so I came home at 6.30 or so after dropping them off and just climbed right back into bed and fell asleep until 11 a.m. I, I mean, I was out hardcore and Ashley didn't wake up until 11.30 and so it was just her and I for the day and so we just, we just took a chill. We didn't do very much for a while and I just kept having phone call after phone call after phone call so I kept doing those. All right, my friend's here. Um, and uh, it just kept occupying my time. And then she luckily was able to get a play date in the middle of that. So I, me being on the phone didn't necessarily, I have to be quiet now, she's still asleep. So that she didn't have to just sit here doing nothing while I was on the phone, which I was glad about. But I um, went pick her up and took her and got some, oh, she got her McFlurry. I don't think I ever said anything. She made it bet with me that she could keep her room clean. You know the messes that girl can make. So she made a bet with me a week ago that she could keep her room clean and her reward was a McFlurry. So I, on her way home from her friend's house, she's like, um, I think you need to cash in on your McFlurry. <laughs> and so we did that together, which was fun. And then um, just one call after another, it just kind of kept happening all night long until probably about 11 o'clock. And I finally sat down and watched Bachelorette at <laughs> 11 o'clock last night and stayed up till midnight. And so when my friend texted me at 8.30 to go walking, I was like, I'm not even functioning yet. <laughs> but she's inspired me. I'll take you on a little bit of the walk if I think about it. Um, but we're gonna start this day off the right way. I am gonna go get my nails done today. Um, and yes, Ashley is home alone. She's fine, she's 10, she's passed out. The doors are all locked. And she has a message from me to call me as soon as she wakes up. But I'm betting I'll be home before she even wakes up. So, <laughs> um, and then I, I'm hoping I can get her to go for a play date this afternoon so that she's occupied and having fun or having a play date here while I'm getting my nails done. Um, so, let's, <laughs> can you hear the frog in my throat? I'm not even like functioning yet. You said it was the last time But you keep coming back to tell me Sorry that you take back All the things you said just to hurt me I love just went cold But I'm still burning I love just went cold Why? Welcome to the world, baby girl. It's 1 p.m. You okay? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not getting my nails done today. We're going to do it tomorrow. 
Okay, she's annoyed that we're filming today. She's like, why are you even filming? Yeah, because you've been filming this whole week. What's no, I didn't film yesterday, to be fair. Oof. We are enjoying our beverages and lunch in the car, correct? Mine's already finished. She thought that there was uh, Squishmallow toys in the kids' meals today, and it was not. Because they posted it four days ago, and yes. so it seemed like they had it, but it was an element. Elemental, elemental toy, which was lame, but we have gotten gas, filled up the car. Abby is almost officially driving very, very soon, and so I wanted to have a fresh full tank of gas in case she wants to use the car. We have a few more weeks till I'm it just occurred to me. Yeah. I have been so focused on her turning 16 and getting her driver's license. It didn't even occur to me that it's her actual birthday. <laughs> I have nothing for her. You serious? I'm dead serious. It didn't, I did not connect those two. Oh to be gosh. fair, she's very specific with what she wants for birthdays and Christmas and whatnot. <laughs> she hasn't sent me a list. It's true. To be fair. So, and she's at camp right now. I don't want to. I don't want to interrupt her. So Saturday when they get home, I'm gonna have to like, okay, really quick. What do you want for your birthday? Kind of home again. It's like like one or two big things that I could just like order it and be done. I I don't know why I didn't make that connection. Regardless, because I I didn't even remember. I only I've just been so focused on her turning 16 and getting her driver's license and then her surgery, and so that's like. I haven't even thought that it was actually a birthday involved. I only remember it because it's like, it's... I know it's her few, birthday. Yeah. Like, that's silly. I don't know why. I, I remember it because it's a few days before starting cheer, so I'm like... Yeah. Okay, anyway, we are at Target right now, and I kind of jumped down a rabbit hole of post-recovery from my surgery videos on TikTok last night. And I'm a little scared. <laughs> I should not have looked at some videos, not of surgeries, but just the recovery process. It's really hot in this car, so we're gonna get going. But I just realized I need some, I remembered from the doctor, he said you need to get some soft ice packs, and I might get some on Amazon, but I'm gonna look here. I'm gonna get some more button-up shirts, because I'm gonna be in those longer than I thought I was going to, and I was gonna get some sweatshirt zip-ups, but it's like 90 degrees, like, it's consistently like 89, 90 degrees. I'm not gonna, even if it's a short sleeve, like sweatshirt, I'm not gonna, it's gonna be too hot. So, we're gonna look at a few things of clothing and, um, uh, yeah, so we're gonna go into Target. We're just kinda killing the day, huh? We're, we're kinda bored. No one to hang out with, nothing to do, but that's okay. We have each other. <laughs> I should look for her birthday presents for Abby. <laughs> yeah. But she, like I said, she's very specific, so I can't just like get her random things. Except for I know what she kind of wants. Yeah, so, so we can like, get her a few little things that I know she would like. Okay, we've got a few more things than I anticipated getting. I am getting treats for certain someone's birthday. I got that checked off. Um, so you can't see that <laughs> in the cart. Um, the ice packs that I have used, like when we got for Kaylee, they're really good. They're like the gel ones that they mold. Um, to your body or whatever, but there's only one in a pack and it was like $9. I'd have to get like two of them. And on Amazon, I found ones that like were for actual like postpartum recovery after having kids and like they're for your bra. Like they actually like mold to the underside of your chest or the upper side of your chest with a little fabric like sleeve that goes over it. So I might actually just get that because it's like the perfect shape. All right, we were gonna show you what we got from the trunk, but it is 90 trunk. degrees out. Trunk? Yeah, the back of the car. It's called the trunk of the car. Well, well I mean. What we got from the trunk? Yeah, I was gonna show you while we stood at the trunk of the car. Oh. Little sass, man. It didn't make sense. But it's 90 degrees outside and I didn't wanna stand in the heat. So, we're stuck in traffic driving home. Um, I didn't realize it was already four o'clock. But when you wake up at noon, one. We will go at one. <laughs> no, I woke up at 12. But. Uh, no, it was like 12.30. I don't know. Anyway, you guys know because you've already seen it. But, um, so we're just, we are sitting in traffic. I'm going two miles an hour. But I ended up getting um, two pillows and some pillowcases because everyone has said, like the videos that I watched, you need to prop yourself up and sleep like that for like a good week. You can't really lay flat on your back. Um, even maybe even for like two weeks and I needed extra pillows and I wanted nicer 
pillows with white pillowcases for my bed to make it look nicer. And so I figured it was a good excuse to get some. Um, and so I can like kind of pile myself up, but I am gonna use one of your Squishmallows. Yeah, I'm gonna, cause that'll be like good solid, like um, height back behind me as I'm laying in bed. Um, and then what else did we get, Ash? We got some birthday treats for the birthday girl. Take we got, we couldn't find a TV tray. Um, I'm gonna order that on Amazon. We couldn't find the ice packs that I wanted, so I'm gonna order those on Amazon. Um, and she wanted to um, spend her money on a set of Legos. We showed you those in the store the other day. The um, flower Legos, um, like Jacob got Kaylee. Um, they're 40 to $60, which is fine. That's the price of Legos. But we happened to find them on another website that is a very popular website these days. And I know that there's pros and cons to ordering from websites like that. So we, we don't need to go into it. But they had these Legos on their website for $13. And I thought that's different than 60. Well, so, correct. So I don't know, we're gonna test it. We're gonna order one or two sets and it might be something fun for me and Ashley to do together with a TV tray sitting on my bed, watching a show or sitting on my couch, watching a show while I recover and give us an activity to do together. Um, I'm gonna go and sit in a cold room and watch TV with a cold glass of water. I'm so hot. And then as soon as um, Jason gets home, we're gonna have ribs for dinner. I just remembered we have ribs left over. So we're gonna make some ribs and maybe some broccoli and have a healthier dinner tonight because we had McDonald's for lunch. <laughs> I didn't have a burger for lunch. I just, anyway. Um, see, we're still st stuck in traffic. We're, all, we're just crawling along here. Um, this is a rush hour traffic for people going home from work and normally I avoid this hour, but like the plague. I'm, but yeah. someone didn't get out of bed. Normally I'm going to Target at 11 in the morning, not four in the afternoon. <laughs> okay, we're speeding up here. See you at home. Okay, got my pens from the pharmacy when we were there. And I have a quick question for you guys. For anyone who has used an injection pen or has needles that they use for medical purposes, putting mine in the fridge. And I actually need, I think there's another one in there. Okay, there we go. This is the one I need. But where do you dispose of your needles? I asked at the pharmacy today and they didn't know. My needles are upstairs, but I don't know where to dispose of them. Trash. No, you can't. You can't dispose of them in the trash. Okay, so we just got the cheapo pillows. These are like the $4 pillows from Target. Six and we're gonna- dollars. No, these ones were the $4 ones. These were the six. No, they weren't. They these weren't. ones were the four. I will look at my receipt, little smart aleck. I also have hanging my new pajama set. The gray one that I got like this is so comfortable. It is so comfortable and the shorts aren't too short because I'm kind of funny like that. I don't like them to be too short if I'm hanging out around the house. Um, so anyway, I just thought that was very fun and I was like, you know what, why not kind of jazz it up if, if I'm gonna be in my pajamas for two weeks. So I'm gonna take that upstairs and then I'm gonna put these pillowcases on um, the pillows. You're weird because you like two on each pillow. I do like two on each pillow because I don't like to, it's a weird thing. Not on these pillow, pillows necessarily, but on my other pillows, I like to have another pillow case on like two layers on it so Kaylee's coming home in two hours yes yes for whatever reason I know Kaylee is coming home today um, from Minnesota because she's going somewhere tomorrow with me <laughs> and I've coordinated all that with her and she has to work tomorrow night and I for whatever reason my brain is not working I don't know what the deal is but Jacob's mom has been texting me all these photos of their trip which I've only gotten a few videos that she sent me um, and I only have pictures so maybe I'll just do a quick little recap of pictures of Jacob and Kaylee's little trip to Minnesota um, luckily she just took pictures of the two of them mostly um, so that she can keep her family private or whatever for her vacation the thing is um, I don't I'd have to ask Kaylee and his family if they're okay Jacob's aunt is a very wealthy person very, very wealthy very. and she hired the Imagine Dragons to play at her kids 
birthday party. Well, just them. Just them. Well, they're part of their friends and their family. So they got to go to her lake house there in Minnesota. And I don't know what lake it is, but her house has been in magazines. <laughs> there. I don't think they stayed there, but they definitely spent time there. And um, so those photos that you will see, that is not like their Verbo. That is his aunt's house. It's a very, so I need to make sure it's okay if we show the pictures and videos of the inside of her home and the outside is obviously like public information because she's been in magazines, but I just need to make sure. Um, but I'll put in a few extra photos of her vacation um, now that she is coming home safely today. Um, I think she's gonna have a <laughs> harsh reality of like, now you need to start working, girl, um, and, and start saving up for tuition. But we're gonna go and do nothing, correct? Yeah. We're hot, tired, we're de I need to get some water and be a little dehydrated. So we're going to go turn on a show. I'm going to turn on a show upstairs. She's going to grab her iPad. And uh, will you put those pillowcases on for me? Thank you. And we're going to chill until Jason comes home in an hour. Um, Kaylee won't be home until like 10 o'clock tonight. She won't, Kaylee won't be home until 10 o'clock tonight. I'm not doing a fire just for you. I love you, but it's yeah. not worth the effort for one person. <sighs> This is the life with one kid at home, and I'm, we're having fun. Yeah. To be fair? Yeah, kind of. Kind of. I'm going to put you in charge, or Kaylee in charge of you for the next day until Chelsea and Ashley are home. Chelsea and Abby. I'm used to saying Chelsea and Ashley. That's why I keep saying it that way, because it's like two I and two. I said it in like to my friends, and she was like, and then Don't you mean, yeah. <laughs> Side note. Ashley made us a cake last night because she's like, Mom, Dad, do you want a cake? I was like, well, that sounds kind of good. She made it, and she's like, why is it so crumbly? Why, why is it so crumbly? I was like, did you add all the ingredients? And she's like, yeah, I added the oil. I added the water. Shoot, I didn't add the eggs. <laughs> so I need to dump all that. It didn't work out. shovel because I've been relaxing on the couch with Ashley perusing websites to make orders and find birthday presents and get stuff for my recovery um, I, in fact I just thought of one more thing I was gonna look and see if we have but I'm hungry Jason came home I am warming up my ribs these are our leftover ribs from last night or not from last night from the 4th of July and this girl is redeeming herself with what cake with Eggs. Eggs. <laughs> Let me make sure it tastes good. Last time I forgot to add eggs to it, so. Mm -hmm. Yep. No, I can't use it. That's pretty good. We're all the only ones eating it. Um, Kaylee is officially on her flight coming home from Minnesota. And okay. she's tired. Her Jacob's mom is like, they're exhausted. <laughs> We're all exhausted. So she's traveling home safely. We'll see her later tonight. You guys won't, likely but maybe she'll want to say hi. Um, so her, our time with Ashley is coming to a close except for Kaylee is going to work a ton now. So <laughs> it's not like um, 
we're still gonna have just Ashley home during the day for the most part. So um, I'm gonna go eat my food and you need to sweep your floors, kiddo. You got away with not doing it yesterday because there weren't any messes. But today it needs to be swept and mopped, okay? Okay? Mm -hmm. Easy.